Hi everyone, my name's Anne-Marie. Welcome to a brand new episode of Cup TV, brought to you by www.craftshoeprint.com. Today we're going to make a gorgeous kit from Janet Morley, Aquarius Designs. It's cup number cup 1046993 underscore 72114. It's called Coffee with Friends. You get six sheets and it makes a gorgeous card. You've got the decoupage, the card front, a choice of inserts. And I'm going to do something a little bit different with it when we get to making the card. But first I'd like to show you the sheets that are included. So the first sheet is the front of the design with some extra panels. And then we've got some gorgeous decoupage of the lovely ladies on the front of the card and some extra sentiment panels. We've got an extra panel with more decoupage of the lovely ladies for the front of the card. And then we've got insert panel number one and two more sentiments. I just want to read you one of these sentiments because I think it's great and it sums me up to a T. And there's no pun there saying tea because it's all about coffee. There's nothing better than a friend with chocolate except a friend with coffee and chocolate. That's right, you would be my friend forever. So we've got lots of sentiments. We've got lots of insert panels. So we've got more sentiments here. And lastly, we've got a planar insert and panels. Maybe you've got more of a message to send. Now, let's make the card and we're going to make it a little bit different. I've taken two pieces of cardstock. One was approximately nine and a half inches by one that was eight and a quarter. The base panel is nine and a half inches and then I've measured one of the panels for size. So I've done it more on eye rather than strictly score here and score there. You'll see as we go along. Now the front panel is the same size as the actual front of the card. The only extra from the 8 inches is what's turned over and stuck to the back. So that's the basis of my card. So the first thing I'm going to do is take the insert that says coffee time I've got flat double sided tape on the back of it and I am simply going to add that to the inside of my card like so. I'm then going to take one of the sentiment panels that says wishing you a fabulous day filled with love and all you wish for. I've got flat tape on the back of it and I'm just going to add it to the side of the insert like so just to one side there we go and then I'm going to take the blank panel again with double sided tape on the back of it and I'm just going to add it to the fold at the end there we go and it's just making it all turn in and match. So now I can turn my attention to the outside of the card. So the first thing I'm going to do is add the full card front image to the front of my card. So I've got flat tape on the large image and I'm just going to position it through the centre of our card base. Just like that. Then I'm going to decoupage the actual sentiment coffee with friends the perfect blend. I've taken the panel I've got 3D foam on the back of it. There we go. So I can just press that down and then I'm going to decoupage the lovely ladies. I've cut out the section for um, one of the ladies. I've got 3D foam on the back and we're just going to marry up the image. There we go. And that's what decoupage is all about. Just building the image higher to portray a 3D version of itself. 
I've taken the second lady, again I've got 3D foam on the back and I'm going to just marry the design up underneath and then take the second layer and again this is slightly smaller than the first but again with 3D foam on and we're just marrying the image layers together there we go to build the front of the card I'm then going to simply add the panel there's nothing better than a friend with chocolate except a friend with coffee and chocolate and I'm going to add it to the other side of the card there we go with flat tape on the back of it and I'm simply just going to pop that down and then press it down and that is our card finished something a little bit different and I just think it works it works very well for the style and the design you could go straight with a straightforward um, card front and the insert but I just think that's a little bit different and sometimes it's good to think outside the box because you can do so much more with the collections that you get and the kits and make them work for you I just want to remind you of the cup number so it was from Janet Morley Aquarius Designs and you can see more of Janet's designs by going to the Craft Show Print website and it's cup number cup 1046993 underscore 72114 and I would just like to say thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time.